Hello, my Vol Gamers. This is Macho Skater here. Oh, yeah, and today I'm doing my seventh ever Brett vlog. Oh, wait, I mean my seventh ever QA. <laughs> uh, um, uh, so, anyway, now before I say anything, uh, I must tell you guys that I'm gonna. But I'm gonna have to split this into multiple parts. Well, it's the first time I did this. You know, basically it was like over 40 minutes, and yeah, it's way too long. So yeah, I'm splitting this into multiple parts. Uh, so anyway, uh, I yeah, so anyway, pretty much, I uh, pretty much, yeah, me and my sons. Man, I and when when uh, when when uh, so basically what I'm trying to say is that basically we'll be answering questions for you guys. So anyway, let's get this started. Alright, so first question is for me. Um, so the first one comes from JJ or Specio. Which one? Radical anti feminist or fuckboy? Uh fuckboy. Because my say Yeah, fuck well yeah, I guess a fuckboy only because I don't know what a radical anti feminist is. I know what a feminist is, is I just don't know what an anti feminist is, but I'm pretty sure an anti feminist and a fuckboy are pretty much the same thing. And uh, and uh, anyway, next question comes from Ma from some Nacho Skater, and, and it's for Keeper. I care. So uh, his question for me is: Is Keeper a Jew because he likes pennies? No, I'm no, I'm not a Jew. Just because I jump at money doesn't make me a Jew. Okay, so next one. Comes from, oops. <laughs> okay, here, so. Okay, so next one comes from Travis Moore, you know. By the replies for it, it seems as though he's not actually, uh, you know, they, he's not actually Travis. So I shall say, so this question comes from the fake Travis Moore. Do Q and A. Do you prefer anal, vaginal, or oral? Um, I guess he prefer vaginal and oral. Yeah, I'm not really anal though. Oh, I guess technically all three are good. But I guess maybe if I were to choose which one's the best, I'd probably say oral. Uh, so next question comes from comes from Dunk. And it's a Alright, run. Okay, it's me. Okay, it's me, Dishback. Okay, James, I have a question for Dishback. It's only he can answer this. Dishback, do you love your father? Well, actually, yes. I do love my dear father. Considering he's always been there for us. You know, even ever since he adopted us. And though we were actually originally his soul brothers. And yes, I know I sound like a smoker right now. But, trust me, it's just my voice. And no, I don't do any smoking or anything, so don't ask. But yes, I love my father. Okay, our next one comes from Nacho Skater. Has douchebag been in a vagina? Well, actually, yes, I've been in a vagina before, long as I've been born before. Now there, but yeah, I've been on a vagina for long as I've been born before from Mama Spice. And yes, that was the name of my biological mother. Okay, oh your dear father, next one for you. Okay, so next one comes from Nacho Skater. Were you actually dating Taylor? Uh, no. Well, actually. Well, actually, no, not well. Actually, not exactly. Only because the thing is, I've actually me and Taylor. I wasn't really actually dating Taylor. We were just bays. You know, we weren't actually dating. Okay, so next one comes from Nacho Skater. Did you just pick your nose? Uh, no, I did not pick my nose in that video. I even pointed it out. Okay, and it seems out we're still. Uh, Going pretty short on this, so I guess we'll have enough, have enough time to do the next one. 
All right, so next one comes from Q and A number seven prep vlog. Look here. All right, so next one comes from the complainers. Okay, okay, it's me, Macho. Look here, it says, hey Macho, how many Nazis did you kill in World War II? Actually, I wasn't around for World War II. Considering... Well, yeah, I wasn't, I wasn't actually here during World War II. I was in Equestria, probably... Like, I wasn't even born yet during that. You know, basically, pretty much... You know, considering pretty much... Considering pretty much most of... You know, for most of my life, I was in the Rainbow Factory. Along with my brothers, we were. That's kind of part of our backstory. Okay, so the next one comes from Donk. James, can you blow me a kiss? There you go. Another one, he says. Another one. Another one. Yes, that's his last another one. Okay, next one. Uh, okay, so this one comes from the complainers. Hey, Keeper, are you Jewish? No, I'm not Jewish. We already established this. Okay. So uh, this one comes comes from the complainers. Hey, douchebag, why are you stealing my girl's heart? Well, actually, I didn't steal your girl's heart. I prefer Scootaloo. Yes, that awesome filly. She shall be mine. Okay. So the next one comes from Mick Diaz. Can you explain the scientific theory of evolution? Um, I guess I could try. Uh, so basically, the scientific theory of evolution or all Darwin's thing. You know, basically his theory and all that. So basically... We first started out, uh, well, basically, all I know is that basically, every day we're evolving, and, you know, kind of, you know, kind of, like, I'm pretty sure within, like, 50 years or so, I'd probably be different than what I look like today. You know, considering, who knows, considering one day, we might even have our own ad ad adaptions or whatever. Okay, here. So, um, wait, on this back zone for you. Yuck, yeah, yeah. So, what is douchebag's thought on his own depression? In his voice, from his words exactly, please. Okay, not Trump. So, my thoughts on depression. Well, my thoughts on depression is that it isn't good. And I'm about to say a lot of people can get depression, and it's not a lot fun. Trust me, it's not. Okay, dear father, this one's for you. Okay, so next one comes from Tyler Tyler Stevenson. Why can't you make a wider variety of videos? Well, I'm trying to. Just that I need time to come up with new ideas and such. In fact, I'm trying to get back into my dancing videos, which I already have been doing. But yeah, yeah I am hoping to make a wider variety of videos soon. Okay, so next one comes from Travis Moore. Er, uh, did you travel back in time to save the elephants in Africa? Uh, no, actually, I did not travel back in time to to save the elephants in Africa. Even though I probably would, don't guess all concerning animals or people too. Okay, so the next question comes from Nacho Skater. When did you become a dance legend? Um, I guess whenever I started doing, I guess maybe whenever I started doing Just Dance and such, I guess that's when I became a dance legend. Okay, so the next question comes from Sire Silos. Are you a pimp? If so, how many hoes do you have? By the way, I will die for you. Uh, no, I'm not exactly a pimp. So, yeah, so... I, 
Uh, again, and uh, yeah, I just got a comment from someone. Yeah, um, yeah, but it's not exactly a question or anything. It was just telling me something about one of my videos. I uh, guess, uh, uh, I am, and I am, I am. So, pretty, like I was saying, yeah, pretty much, I'm pretty much, yeah, so pretty much, yeah, I'm not exactly a pimp, or at least I'm not in my opinion. I don't care, so if you had to pick, would, which would you be? A slave or a Jew? Um, probably a slave. Okay, next one. The next question comes from Andrew Wall. Okay, do you have multiple personality disorder? Uh, no, Andrew, I do not have multiple personality disorder. I just, I just share, I just share, I just that I have, I just that I share souls. With my four sons. In fact, the back thing is, the back thing is, whenever it comes to our mind structure, I have mine in the middle, then there's branch out from mine. Kind of like, for example, I have machos, douchebags, matching mans, and keepers. All connected to my mind. Don't hurt yourself thinking about it. Trust me, it took me a while to think about it. Yeah, yeah it's kind of complicated. Up here. Okay, right, so next question comes from Dunk. Hey, Papa James, please tell us about the Pony Journal. Not all of it, just your favorite parts. All right, so basically my Pony Journal, yeah, it's a, it's basically my Pony Journal is basically a private journal that I write on, the, you know, basically or something Pony related happens to me. In fact, it's usually it's like dreams, time when I not get visited by ponies, and also whenever I go to Equestria. That's basically the three main things. In which I, you know, basically, in which I, yeah, that's basically like the three main categories. Okay, right, so next one, so next question comes from Orlando Montalvo. You like anal? I uh, know I don't like anal. I prefer vaginal and oral. I I hear. Okay, uh, so this one comes to the complainist. Hey, Magic Man, what's your favorite type of cereal? Oh, well, my favorite type of cereal is Fruit Loops. And I bet you were thinking that I say Lucky Charms, but no, I don't like marshmallows. None of us do. Okay. Uh. Okay, so the next question... Comes from not Trump. Can can Macho and Magic Man have an argument over who gets the bang Fluttershy? Okay, now let me get you. Now let me tell you one thing. I'm dating Fluttershy. Me and her adopted Macho douchebag Magic Man Keeper. So therefore, they're our sons. So why will they bang their mother? That makes say. Oh my God, dude. Oh my God, it's like guys are so obsessed with that. Yeah, it's like everyone's trying to trying to bang my trying to bang my special sun pony. Okay, here, so next question comes from Nacho Skater. How's the book coming along? Oh, uh, so if you guys don't know, I'm I'm actually writing a book on the sidelines. You know, actually I've been writing a book. I'm actually in my third year of writing it. It's a book called The Ultimate Showdown. Though some of my friends know about it. In fact, some of my friends are actually in the book. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, it's coming along pretty good. Okay, our next question comes from JJ or Specio. Why do you have a fetish for money? A fetish with money? Actually, I don't have a fetish with money. Back up. One of us has a fetish with money, but I won't say who it is. It's, during, it's not me. Okay, our next question comes from Donk. James. Would you be supportive of Keeper if he came out as homosexual, or would you banish him? Um, actually, well, actually, I wouldn't banish him, you know, I'd accept him if he was a homosexual, but I already know who his love interest is. Hey, right, my fellow gamers, I'm back. Sorry, my video got cut short on this. My mom called me, and I didn't have it on Do Not Disturb. Oh, yeah, so, anyway, so, like I was saying, oh, yeah, so, pretty much... When, 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 uh, 
when I had, when I had to have Prince Lego Sam, it's all Prince Lego Sam, pretty much, he was that, pretty much, yeah, yeah so pretty much if, Keep actually was homosexual, I wouldn't banish him, but I know he's not a homosexual. Okay, so, I hear, so yeah, anyway, next question comes from Not Trump. Could you read uh, some of your pony journal? I'd really appreciate hearing the juiciest of tales from you, my friend. Love, not Trump. Barley, if you don't read in some of your pony journal, I'm kicking the chair. Okay, okay, you don't have to kill yourself. And I do know that's what you meant by that. Well, okay, when I come, I think it's like I'm gonna, I'm gonna cut the video short right here. Again, well, my I'll fellow gamers, I'm back again. I uh, um, um, I uh, so now I'm um, guess I'll let's read you the first journal entry that I made in my pony journal. Okay, here. February 2nd, 2015. Last night I had a dream. What happened is that I was at school. I threw up and everyone told me I have this disease called running ad. So my dad picked me up from school and drove me on down to Target. And then in there I was standing in the middle of the store and my dad came up to me and handed me a Fluttershy plushie. He asked, he asked if that's what I wanted. I said yes and started hugging it while walking. Next thing I knew we were driving to my house. Along the way there, I was thinking that I wouldn't be able to run away. Kind of like how a pet wouldn't eventually run away or something. Well, my plushie couldn't do that. I got into my bed with a Fluttershy plushie and fell asleep with it. Next thing I knew, I woke up in the middle of the night. I looked for the plushie and then realized it was all just a dream. Then I was sad. Then this morning, I looked to see if running out was a thing. Maybe I'm a little obsessed with loving ponies. Or at least Fluttershy. And now, look at me nowadays. I'm actually dating her. I asked him now anyway. I asked so I asked now anyway. Next question comes from Nacho Skater. Why do you make these uh, people around you? And of course he's talking about my vlogs. I guess well, the reason I make those for people around me is only it's only that way I, I can spice it up. Yeah, that's basically why. Okay, so next question comes from Dong. James, can you tell us what a stallion means in Equestria? Yeah, so basically a stallion is basically the equivalent of a man. Yeah, that's basically what a stallion is in Equestria. It's basically the equivalent of a human man. Okay, so next question comes from Nacho Skater. Is Keeper a Jew nigger? Hey, it's not very nice. I'm not a Jew and I'm definitely not a nigger. I'm, I'm a business pony. Okay. Okay, so next question comes from Apple Fritter. Macho, er, Macho, though he's talking about me, because I asked him who he's asking, and he said the real you. Uh, so he said, Macho, are your parents aware that you have four imaginary sons? And if so, do they support your decisions? Okay, well, first of all, they're not imaginary, and plus my parents don't know about them. Okay, so next one comes from Not Trump. Uh, this one's for you, Keeper. I care. It says, Dear Keeper, can you please sing us a song? Well, I guess I could. So this one is called. It's called Children of the Night. Oh, no, give me a second. I gotta pull it up. Here we go. Little children, I'll take thee away into a land of enchantment. Come, little children, the time's come to play here in my garden of shell. Hello, sweet children, I show thee the way through all the pain and the sorrows. Weep not, poor children, life is this way. 
we're in beauty and passions. Hush now, dear children, it must be this way. Too weary of life and deceptions. Rest now, my children, for soon we'll away into the calm and the quiet. Ooh, 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 ooh. Come, little children, we'll take thee away into a land of enchantment. Come, little children, the time's come to play here in my garden shadow. Well, my fellow gamers, I'm afraid this is all time I have for today. Now, anyway, hit the like button. Uh, hit the like button below if you enjoyed. And why not subscribe to be linked to my channel as it grows into greatness. And uh, as I always say, sending you to my friends, Macho Skater. Sign out till next time. Oh, yeah, and by the way, I will answer more questions next time.